This is what it looks like when your plane engine fails mid-flight. You're seeing what the pilot saw as he plummeted to the ground. It's genuinely real footage, and what happened next was astonishing. Chad Barber was a skilled pilot. With experience in dozens of aircraft and thousands of hours of flight time, it's safe to say he knew his way around the sky. But on this occasion in 2018, when he was taking a one-man biplane for a spin, things went wrong. At about 2,500 feet, during a routine maneuver, the propeller stopped spinning. Despite several attempts, Chad couldn't get any fuel to the engine and quickly found himself in a nosedive. Travelling at more than 100 miles per hour, unless his luck changed, he would hit the ground in less than a minute. As he frantically searched for a place to crash land, his cockpit camera captured everything. This is what happened next. At around 50 feet, the engine suddenly restarted. Chad was able to pull up just when a crash landing had seemed inevitable. He survived to tell the tale, and that's exactly what he's about to do. All of a sudden, I hear a deafening silence. My engine shuts off. At that point, we're going down. During that particular maneuver, the fuel couldn't make it to the engine. So it was a combination of a little bit of fuel and that weird angle that the engine can pick it up. You're hopeless. You have nothing you can do. No matter if you get the engine started or not, if you can't control this, this object in the air, your best next option would be to, to use a parachute to jump out. I don't know if the engine's going to restart. Chad's near-death experience hasn't put him off flying. I continue to do it. I love doing it. It's, I couldn't think of another way to spend my life. And he's still performing tricks in the sky today. I own another aerobatic airplane right now, and it's a lot of fun. He posts videos of his antics on social media accounts under Barber Aviation. You can see some more crazy videos. Nothing like that, though. Thankfully, he's still alive to do what he enjoys most.